I don't need an extra studio. I don't have people working for me or being a photographer or other talent that I work with. It's just me and I do everything myself and my apartment is pretty good size. And really, I don't need like a studio studio because then it wouldn't like look like I'm home, which I am home. And I think part of the appeal is that you're talking to a, a real person that has a real life and has a place and they're not in a studio in a cubicle or something. So yeah, I don't really need a studio. I mean, there might be, there may be a time in the future that I rent space or a cabin with like a big fireplace or something. Um, but normally I just shoot in my home and I just, you know, I have my, my apartment, but it's actually a really like big size and I'm a small person and I know how to do set design and all kinds of things to sh shift things around and make them look different. So if I do need some particular type of set, I can usually like make it work in the fantasy realm of things because things can be pretty simple. Um, with camera magic and movie magic and makeup and hair and outfits, you can, you know, and set design, a little bit of props strategically placed, you can make an apartment look like a doctor's office or it can look like an, a, an executive office or, um, you know, just regular rooms that you would have in your home anyway. <laughs>